Hello, my name is Jerry Wilson. I'm the owner of Hospitality Technology Solutions. I've been in the point of sale business for over 30 years. My company was designed to bring technology to aid business owners like you so you could control your people, product, payments, and profits. In this video, we're going to talk about a concept of theft that's a lot harder to detect than others. This one's a little more difficult. In our industry, the point of sale industry, uh, there's a common rule of thumb, and that is you judge how much a bartender is stealing by the car they drive. Now, I've told this to a bar owner before, and he, he said, just wait just a minute. And he got up, and he walked out, and, out of the restaurant and looked out in the parking lot, came back a whole lot madder than when he left, mumbling something about how he was going to have to have a talk with the bartender. Think about it. How many bartenders do you know that drive a Yugo? Probably not many. They're probably a little bit on the luxury car side of things, don't you think? In this case, the bartenders, one of the things they'll do is that they'll bring their own bottle of liquor to work with them. If your restaurant or bar is real popular with a Jack and Coke, he's going to bring a bottle of Jack Daniels and he's going to pour out of his bottle rather than yours. And he's going to take the money rather than put it in the drawer. Now, I've, I've helped a restaurant owner before who was trying to balance a, a charge slip. And the charge slip was for $75. He saw that the ticket had a $5 drink and $70 tip. And he just couldn't figure out why his bartender was getting a $70 tip. Well, that's real simple. He just rang the first Jack and Coke. He poured the rest of them out of his own bottle. Now, the restaurant owner, his inventory is balanced, but his profits are gone. Another way that employees can steal from you is with the new technology. Did you know that uh, there's a product called Square? And with that product, you can have, your employees can have point of sale on your iPad. You can go to Walmart and for $9.86, you or your employee can get a Square account, have a little Square mag card reader on their iPad. This happened to me when I was at an airport. I was flying through a city and went through the food court. And there was this little restaurant there, single employee working. I go up and I'm in line and I see the person in front of me. They get their, get their order and cashier, she rings it up on the, on the cash register and gives them a receipt. Takes my order gets my food and she says, would you like, how would you like to pay for this? I said, I'll pay with a credit card. Okay, do you need a receipt? No, I don't need a receipt. So she then rang it up on her iPad. She rang it through on her Square account. The sale went into her bank account, not the restaurant's. So this one's gonna be a little harder to detect. You've got a bartender who's bringing in his own bottle or you have an employee who's bringing in their own point of sale system. Either one is going to take a little extra effort on your part. For the bartender, you're going to have to be more observant with what they're doing. Uh, a poll display, simply adding a poll display to your point of sale or register, pointing it in a direction that you can then monitor to see what they're ringing up and what they're pouring. You can also put in a camera system that will also detect or watch what the bartender is doing. That one's a little more difficult because it's going to require you to watch a lot of video. Involvement and, and being observant is what you're going to have to do to catch that bartender pouring out of their own bottle. As far as is the cashier bringing their own point of sale system, again, you're going to have to be involved. This particular restaurant did not have a manager. It was in a series of food court uh, operations with a single employee. But there's nothing wrong with you as the owner popping in on that employee. Look for the other point of sale devices. It doesn't have to be an iPad. It could be an iPhone. So be observant. Look for what's going on in order to catch those people stealing from you. My name is Jerry Wilson. I'm the owner of Hospitality Technology Solutions. I've been in the point of sale business for over 30 years. I'm trying to put my expertise in catching thieves to work for you. If you like what you've seen, subscribe to the channel. Hit the share button. 
take that link, share it with other business owners like yourself who you think might benefit from this. What I want, what I want to do is to stop your employees from taking home more money than you do.